Viewer discretion is advised. If you just know you're that girl, yeah. you just have no choice but to be that girl. And I feel like I'm that girl. What if you don't wake up feeling like that girl? How do you be that girl? You need to go back to sleep and wake back up again so you can feel like that girl. There you have it, child. That's why I feel like I'm the T. I feel like I'm the T because I work at being the T. <laughs> like, no shade. I'm not the T just because a bunch of bitches like me and live for me because we all homegirls. I'm the T because I'm the motherfucking T. And that's just sad. <laughs> like, like, I, I mean, that's just what it is. People legit in the world love to live for food. Love, 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 love to live for food. Love to live for your bald head home girl that do bald head home shit. Like, like it's like it's clear that I'm I'm working at being the sea soldier. Let me be the sea. <laughs> like give me that. Give me my flowers. Who girl? So Tory Lanes is guilty as fuck. Hmm. What did I tell you guys? What if everybody else? What did Megan tell y'all, girl? So when a black woman screams from the rooftops, child that she is a victim of aggravated assault with a deadly weapon, honey. Hello, God. Huh. You know, attempted murder vibes, okay? Y'all don't wanna believe, we gotta go to court, all of this stuff. And then people still don't believe. Did y'all see the way that daddy, I didn't, girl, <laughs> leprechauns. They are some, let me tell you something about little man syndrome, girl. Y'all little people, girl. Y'all are so angry at life. I, I can only imagine being three foot tall, girl, running around here with your pot of gold, girl, catching the rainbows to, so you can transport yourself little distances because, girl, you can't get there fast enough because those little tiny demon legs of yours, girl, okay? It's just sad, girl. He rampant, raving God and talking about Rock Nation. Now Rock Nation's at fault for the girl. Like... <laughs> Y'all got that little girl, that little girl, I guess that's his sister or whatever girl, uh, child. She over here sounding like that girl with the breastplate of righteousness, uh, Derek Jackson's old delusional ass wife, child. So that's how y'all building them up now. Okay. <laughs> this ain't got nothing to do with God and the devil, honey. This is everything with a man, hello God, with a God complex, with a short man complex, hello God, thinking that he can do anything he wants and get, to, and get away with it. No God. And then to make matters even worse, all of these people willing to fall on their male toxic swords for this bitch, Tory Lanez, and come to find out, shout out to the leaked audio girl of you basically admitting what you've done. Your crime against Megan Thee Stallion. So you furthermore perjured yourself. Is this another charge? Can we get another charge added on here for Kelsey too? Hello, God. Can we do that, please? Can we? Y'all floating around petitions, but won't float around a petition, hello, God, to your local politicians to change some of these damn laws that obviously are affecting black communities negatively. You won't go to the March on Washington, hello God, when black lives are getting murdered all the time, but you wanna fall on your mother. <coughs> oh God. <coughs> I get mad when I think about the bigger picture, girl. Where are the petitions when they're killing black and brown children in the streets? Where are the fucking petitions when these politicians are obviously putting special interest and in lining their pockets over serving the fucking communities that put them in power to begin with. Girl. That's why we deserve what it is that we deserve sometimes because we're so fucking dumb. Y'all, y'all don't even know this man. Y'all don't know none of these celebrities, but the shit you're willing to put up with to believe your favorite girl because they got the hit song 
because they represent all the sorry ass values that you represent. Girl, please take that same power, that same fucking energy and put it towards something useful, something meaningful, something that's really going to change the direction of the human experience. The same energy I put into these petitions to save a sorry ass attempted murderer like Tory Lane's ass put towards helping to save the world from climate change. Hello, God. Terrorist. Our own government wants us dead. Put that same energy into what they're doing to our food, girl. Put that same energy to the scientists who are out here experimenting on human beings, girl. It's infuriating. The lengths we will go to, to for stuff like that. When the literal world is crashing down around us. Take those petitions to the Department of Children and Families who are letting shit slip through the cracks that are getting these children killed by their parents and foster parents, girl. Put that same petition to end homelessness in your cities, girl. To lower these fucking gas prices, girl. Lower the cost of food, girl. But y'all want to defend a blatant, nasty, raggedy-ass, leprechaun-built bitch like Tory Lanez. When are we gonna not no longer give a fuck about rich people problems, girl? Girl, this is not how I wanted to start off the fucking new year, bitch. But I, you, when you think about it on the mass level, girl, you have no fucking choice but to get pissed the fuck off. And if you don't, you're part of the problem, you raggedy ass bitches. We all want tea, we all want drama, but the literal world is folding in on our motherfucking ass. And if you ask me, we deserve every bit of that shit. <clears throat> Sorry ass people in this world. Y'all bitches are the reason why we got all the fucking problems we got now. Fuck out of here. Sorry ass fucking people in this world, in this life. We don't deserve shit good. People are literally starving right now. There is a famine. There is a war going on right now around the world globally, girl. The things we choose to care about. Y'all want to bring God in this girl. No, it ain't got nothing to do with no God, no devils, no none, no demons. None. This is us. And if this is who we're going to continue to be, we don't deserve Mother Earth, girl. Why y'all think I done changed a lot of the direction of my play? It's meaningless. Watching stories every day of people really going through some shit. Watching the Earth deteriorate around us, girl. The Ozo, I'm... I know y'all like this whole crazy. I don't give a fuck. Y'all ain't gonna be calling me crazy when the motherfucking shit crash into itself. We all around here gasping for air. We are all exploding as we leave the house, girl, because it's too fucking hot around this bitch. When your ass is paying 10 fucking dollars for a loaf of milk. That bitch YB, he wasn't cut crazy after all. No, I wasn't, bitch. Pay attention! Or maybe it is because... <laughs> Of all the darkness and calamity, we choose to turn a blind. We turn, turn to our, whatever. Y'all know what the fuck I'm trying to say, girl. We choose to turn our motherfucking eyes, girl. We don't want to notice. Girl, it's obvious. It's everywhere, girl. Hurry up, bitch. You're driving too slow. Y'all hoes are a mess. Okay? Not y'all hoes, but y'all hoes. Okay, period. Girl, please, we gotta do better, girl. We and it's unfortunately it's too late to do better, in my opinion. We can't reverse all that we've done to this planet. 
what we've done to one another. And we're really gonna run around this bitch caping for a fuck nigga. When we need to be caping for ourselves, you need to put on that Superman cape girl to save the fucking planet. There will be nothing to argue and fight about if the earth continue, if the people of this earth continue to do the shit that they do. Everyone's talking about this spiritual war. Girl, it, it's not, girl, it's nothing that's hidden. We see it all the time. There's a war against the black man. There's a war against men. There's a war against fathers in particular. And I'm going to do a live about that coming up soon because I've been doing a lot of thinking, girl. There is a war against fatherhood in this country and in this world. Fathers that want to love their children are being demonized and being called sexual, child sexual predators, girl, because they genuinely want to love and show affection to their children. <clears throat> We're going to get deeper on that, girl, in another video, girl. We're going to go live and have that conversation, girl, because I'm sick of the bullshit. And we also got to talk about some of these sorry ass women in this life, too. We're going to dig into y'all raggedy dry pussy asses as well, honey. Okay? There's much truth and justice to be served in this motherfucker, girl. And that's on period. And best believe, YB Entertainment TV, we're going to get to the T, honey. Yeah, bitch, I'm back. And we'll be in full effect. Coming soon, bitch. Coming motherfucking soon. As I sit back in this life and I bear witness to the foolishness of it all. And don't, but Tasha K, Storm and Row, um, Armand Wiggins, and I talk about some of these people too, no lie. But girl, the y'all are on these folks' dicks as if they're out here making the world go round. They are not. These people are just the distraction, honey. They are the literal smoking mirrors. Okay? We real human beings got real shit going on and real things that need to be addressed. Topics that need to be talked about in length with our community. Y'all love this popular genre. Girl, if you're not paying attention, that is a smoke and a mirror, girl. To drive your attention somewhere else while the real shit that's going on around you is going to fold your motherfucking ass. Because you're too stupid and small-minded to take to look through the forest, through the trees, girl. Girl, no wonder the aliens haven't committed mass. We're not worth it. We kill ourselves. <clears throat> girl, please. We deserve nothing but what's coming to us, girl. Whether it's death and calamity, destruction, all the things, darkness, girl, we deserve everything. Because human beings, we ain't shit. On every level, when you think about it, we ain't shit. Arguing about some motherfucking Tory lanes. Will you be arguing about him in a couple of years, girl, when you're starving? Hello, God, when you can't find any clean water, girl? Hello, God, when, when you're over here looking stupid? You know what kills me about Tory Lanez thing, too? I, when I, I posted a video to TikTok, girl, some dumb bitch got in my comments and it was a black woman talking down on me because I'm defending a black woman. Let me tell you something. Not only am I here to defend Megan, the, the girls like Megan Thee Stallion, I'm here to stand with my women, period. Whether you are red, yellow, black, or white, girl, you are precious in thine sight. And the fact that a black woman cussed me out and tried to ridicule my opinion lets me know that y'all bitches are part of the problem, too. Called me a girl boy. Bitch, I'm a man. 
a gay man trying. Well, I'm not gay. No, I've been delivered, y'all. Hello, God. I'm not gay no more, child. Okay. I'm just, you know, fluid, girl. Okay. But over here, you you have an ally, girl. You have someone who is using their platform to speak out truth and justice for you. Y'all the same hoes that sit on the side and let your nigga beat your motherfucking ass. Call the police on that man and everything, girl. And then when the police come say, oh, nothing happened. I fell. I ran into the cabinet. Girl, shut your ass up, you dumb bitch. Y'all really be trying to shit on your advocates, girl. And what kills me too is us gay black men, we fucking go to the heavens and the earth, girl, to defend our lovely women. We do all the time. <clears throat> I told you plenty of times on this platform, I've had homegirls who have been in domestic violence situations and I have spoken out. I've actually whooped niggas ass for these women only for them to get back with that guy. It's psychological. It's pathological. I'm not put on this planet to save you hoes. I'm here to save the ones who want to learn from their shit, who want to overcome their shit. It's 2023 now. We ain't got time for that drama, girl. <coughs> There's bigger fish to fly. Fuck domestic violence if the world is caving around us, girl. When there's nothing left to eat, we gotta really start pulling our shit together, girl. I'm thinking about the bigger issues. Hello? The bigger issues, bitch. These people have been poisoning our food for years and you wonder why our children, the past few generations, have been born the way they've been born. Mentally, physically, psychologically fucked up individuals. Because oh, God don't make mistakes. You're right, he don't. So why would he then create something that has a meaningless life? Let's just tell the truth. Call me a dark bitch all you want to, but let's tell everything in life serves purpose. What is the purpose of a quadriplegic who can't think for themselves? Someone who is in a vegetable state. There's no purpose for them. It is because we've indoctrinated this whole food pyramid, girl. Feeding our children is bullshit. Feeding, and then you become a parent. You now have given birth to this disease-filled ridden child because of the bullshit you've been eating, because of the bullshit your people ate, because of the bullshit their people's people ate. Told the girls to have cereal, eggs, and sausage, and all this other shit. Okay, if it was clean, that's fine. But all the additives and all the substitutions and all the hormones and all the bullshit they've been putting in our food for years and years and years and years and years. You don't think that ha that's a major contributing factor to why a lot of these motherfuckers are growing up the way they are? All of these fucking issues? Girl, please. Why is this guy driving so slow? Girl, don't let me pay attention to you. Girl, please. <clears throat> The bigger picture, everybody got that little thing that nah, thought that was gonna save you. What are they finding out now? Girl, that the people that didn't get that bullshit were actually better off. Yeah, a lot of the girls out here were condemning the girls for not getting the holy grail of fucking transfusions, right, honey? You thought that thing, that thing was magic, it was gonna save you. When really the most of those deaths, hello God, I'm speaking in code because I don't want them taking this video down. Most of those deaths were people who actually got the miracle cure. Hello, bitch. But y'all want to get on my channel and motherfucking ridicule me for misinformation. Girl, that's y'all dumbasses taking something that y'all don't, they don't even know what it is. <coughs> the doctors came out. They did a press conference not too long ago. They don't even train doctors in how to, what is, even goes into a vaccine. They don't even know the proper procedure for how to create one. They're not taught about the cures. They're taught about the treatments. Cause that's more profitable. That's more palatable for stockholders, girl. Investors. 
It just came out that Dr. Fauci girl's under fire because he funded the very lab that created the bullshit to begin with. But you want to lean on thine understanding. Girl, white supremacy got y'all all fucked up and socially conditioned, girl. Get y'all shit together, girl. Get y'all shit together, girl. Because let me tell you something. In the heat of the night, girl, when you least expect it, you're going to be dwelling on the very truth that YB Entertainment TV has been trying to speak to you dumb motherfuckers for the longest. These people are ripping up the very fabric of human existence, girl. Our realities are no longer our own. And until we can see through the fakery, the fuckery, and the fraudulence of it all, we deserve every fucking bit of what's coming our way. And that's on Periana to the motherfucking period, bitch. Y'all be blessed and never stressed. Have a great day, girl. Remember that health is wealth. And open your fucking third eye and pay attention. And if you ain't as mad as me in this moment, then fuck you. Find a new channel.